I'm warm. I'm always warm. Here's what I do. I move my consciousness. If it's freezing in New York, my consciousness does not say, ooh, it's so cold. Ooh, I'm freezing. Aren't you freezing? I'm so cold. Oh, my God, it's freezing here. The weather is freezing. It's so freezing. Everybody knows it's cold there. <laughs> what do I have to say? I have a wetsuit, right. <laughs> what do I have to tell them? I just put clothes on. It's hot. Okay, it's not going to be hot forever. This too shall pass. Maybe hot for a month. Maybe two. Don't make big deals over little things that don't matter. Don't get dramatic and don't take everything personally. And don't believe your feelings, especially intense feelings, because intense feelings don't necessarily tell you the truth. They, intense feelings, either way, can hide reality, can camouflage reality. And when we rationalize, when we rationalize, those are selfish ways in which we're justifying ourselves somewhere. So, all right, let's get still. Take a breath. And allow yourself to just sink. Sink into the sweetness. Into the stillness. And release anything that's on your mind right now. Just let it go. Just let it melt away. And bring yourself into a place of being fully present in your heart. And let's tune in to the collective field of consciousness. The collective heart that's right here today. The one heart. Your heart is connected to every <coughs> single heart here. Tune into that feeling. How does that feel? Feel the preciousness of that energy of the one heart. <clears throat> and sense in this consciousness that we are agents, each of us, for consciousness to evolve, for spirit to become manifest on earth in harmony, in unity, and in integration. Surrender now. Just allow yourself to be vulnerable, to be open, And I invite you now to connect with your deepest recognition of what human life can be. Your own deep insight or spiritual experience that you may have had about what human life can be. It may have been through a meditation you've had or a retreat you've been on a moment of intimacy with somebody. And allow that sense of possibility that you touched to come forward. And just take a few moments to be alone with your deepest recognition of what life could be.
open to what you sense is possible for a human being to become. To be. For a human being to express or to know or to give what's possible. And bring forward in consciousness what you sense might be possible for human beings together. What is the greatest possibility that you can sense for human beings together? <laughs> 